My name's Ramya, I'm a sonographer. I take ultrasound scans. So ultrasound is a high frequency sound wave. Sound waves pass through the tissues and then reflect back to the transducer. That will then be displayed on the screen as a real-time image. The ultrasound is completely safe. It doesn't use radiation, it uses sound waves. So it's safe for you and your baby. The 18 to 22 week ultrasound scan is an important medical test. It assesses the health of your baby and allows us to have a good look at baby's anatomy. The reason why it's done at this time is because baby's anatomy is now large enough, so things like the heart and the head were able to see it much better than earlier on. It's also used um, for us to have a look at the cervix and the placenta and to give a due date if that's not already known. There's very little preparation for this scan. When you make your appointment, just let the reception staff know. They'll let you know if you need to do anything beforehand. Sometimes you might need to fill your bladder. If you wear loose and comfortable clothing, which allows us to access your lower abdomen and pelvis, you won't need to get changed into a gown. Sound waves don't pass through air, so we'll need to put some gel on the lower abdomen, on your skin. We then use a transducer to image baby. Sometimes a little bit of pressure might need to be placed on your abdomen. This might be a little bit uncomfortable, but it shouldn't be painful. And occasionally you'll need to roll onto your side so that we get a clearer picture. For an obstetric ultrasound scan, usually it takes about 30 to 45 minutes. Sometimes it might take a bit longer depending on baby's position. We realise that it's a really exciting opportunity to see your unborn baby. So the sonographer will point out things as they're scanning and will show you particular areas such as the face. The ultrasound scan involves a lot of detailed measurements and pictures of baby. So sometimes because of the amount of concentration that's required, the explanation might be limited. Our role is to take images of your baby. These will then be reviewed by a specialist doctor called a radiologist. They'll then write a written report which will go back to your doctor. If you'd like to know the gender of your baby or you'd rather it be a surprise, just let the sonographer know and they can tell you or not tell you based on your preferences. Sometimes though the visibility of the gender might be obscured by baby's position and it's not 100% accurate. So typically one person is allowed to come with you for your scan to support you. The scan requires high levels of concentration on part of the sonographer, so distractions from other people in the room might be detrimental to your test. Where possible, try and leave um, small children at home. They often find it hard to tolerate the length of the test. Their noisy electronic devices are not permitted in the room. Some clinics provide um, DVDs for obstetric scans. When you make your appointment, just let the reception staff know and um, they'll let you know if the DVD facility is available at that clinic. Otherwise, um, the sonographer can put up an image on the screen and you can take a photo with your iPhone or your device and they might also give you little pictures to take with you. After your scan, the results will usually take up to two days to go back to your doctor.